Tori Spelling is so over 2023 after another one of her kids is taken to urgent care. Tori Spelling is ready to move on from a dramatic 2023. On Tuesday, December 26, the mother of five uploaded a series of Instagram stories of her family at a medical facility. The first snap showed Spelling's oldest son's foot cast along with the message, sutures out from his foot surgery and second cast on. The next image adorably showed her youngest son, Bo, six, signing brother Liam's black cast. A third post alluded that Bo had a medical mishap of his own, adding even more stress to the single mom's plate. And, then to urgent care. I'm so over 2023, she penned on the image of herself and Bo napping. The Beverly Hills, 90,210 alums uploads came after a particularly tough year. This summer, the actress and husband Dean McDermott split, leaving Tori to take care of the couple's five kids amid supposed financial troubles. The blonde beauty and her tots were even spotted living in a mobile home for an extended period of time, reportedly due to a mold infestation at their house. The matriarch, who is now living in a rental home with the children, recently admitted how difficult Christmas has been without her former lover. It's December 22nd and I officially bought my first gift for Christmas, she wrote on her Instagram story. Five Christmas lists to tackle. Three days to do. Missed the at Amazon Prime cut off. Now I have to brave them all alone. Crushing this single mom Christmas 2023, she added. On top of taking care of the kids on her own, Tori had to deal with Dean sharing the intimate details of their split in a November interview. Alcohol made me feel good enough. I started feeling good enough until it got to a point where it didn't. It ended up in isolation. The actor revealed of his addiction, which led to the pair calling it quits. It ended up with me drinking a fifth of tequila every night, seven days a week and a handful of prescription medications, by myself with a beautiful family in the other room. Dean explained. That's what it led to and that's what led to the brokenness and to what happened between me and Tori. Tori came from just such a place of love and wanting me to be healthy and happy. It was codependence, he noted. She put my well-being well ahead of hers. She loved me so much that she didn't really want to tell me how it was affecting her, although I could see it in her face. Eventually, the father of six realized he couldn't live that life anymore, so he checked into a rehabilitation facility and is now sober. That's what we can report. Thank you for watching this news. Don't forget to help this news office channel by liking comments, sharing and subscribing. We thank you for your support.